Now, if a thousand perfect men were to appear, it would not amaze me. Now, if a thousand beautiful forms of women appeared, it would not astonish me. Now I see the secret of making the best persons is to grow in the open air and to eat and sleep with the earth. Here a great personal deed has room. Such a deed seizes upon the hearts of the whole race of men. Its effusion of strength and will overwhelms law and mocks all authority and all argument against it. Here is the test of wisdom. Wisdom is not finally tested in schools. Wisdom cannot be passed from one having it to another not having it. Wisdom is of the soul, is not susceptible of proof. It is its own proof. Applies to all stages and objects and qualities and is content. Is the certainty of reality and the immortality of things and the excellence of things. Something there is in the float of the sight of things that provo provokes it out of the soul. Now I re-examine philosophies and religions. They may prove well in lecture rooms, yet not prove at all under the spacious clouds and along the landscape with flowing currents. Here is realization. Here is a man tallied. He realizes here what he has in him. The past, the future, majesty, love. If they are vacant of you, you are vacant of them. Only the kernel of every object nourishes. Where is he who tears off husks for you and me? Where is he that undoes stratagems and envelops for you and me? Here is adhesiveness. It is not previously fashioned. It is apropos. Do you know what it is as you pass to be loved by strangers? Do you know the talk of those turning eyeballs?